for that. Uh, I, the one thing, I know you were talking about the, the character from a bygone era. Uh, I do think the character model was actually like very distracting in not a good way because like the, with the camera angles chosen, it just felt like this game seems like a, a game that came out in like 002 in terms of its, you know, like character design. It's like a bit old and, and not flattering, I don't think, for a modern audience. In comparison to something like Forspoken, which has, you know, uh, I mean, yes, it has a much more... Ah, uh, yes. The cringe beta games journalist strike again. Amazing. Uh, I don't I don't like it when uh, women are beautiful and they have body parts. But when it's guys, guys, you don't understand. When it's men, it's okay. Men don't understand it like women do. Even though all throughout the 90s, sex appeal was still used on men and women pretty equally. Oh man, my boys Duke and Doom Guy. I don't know rippling abs rippling biceps i don't know that doesn't that's not the same as big boobs right guys even though that's things women generally find attractive and that's what sex appeal literally means oh but no 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 it's only when it's a girl that it's a problem come on guys i'm a game journalist i would never lie to you I only know proper standards because I'm very smart, I'm very intellectual, and I I stand with the women's movement. Come on. Imagine unironically saying woman from a bygone era as if attractive men and women just stopped existing after 2002 or the early 2000s. Jesus Christ, this is some beta shit. Fuck games journalist statement still stands true and it always will fuck these people <laughs> god stay strong boys